So this right here that was dropped yesterday by Joe Staten should make every single individual in the community extremely excited and hopeful for the future of Halo. I know it's been rough up to this point, but with the Forge beta quite literally only three days away, 72 hours away, uh, I wanted to share this because this is something that the community has been asking for for quite literally probably over 10 years i think it was like over a decade 10 12 years ever since uh halo 3 ever since forge began is it possible to add campaign ai in forge are you guys working on it and i believe michael wrote this and the response was it's possible and we are looking and we are working on how to best bring these features from our internal tools into forge at a later date so a later date might be uh, like a year from now, I would imagine. We see a lot of potential in allowing players to create experiences that lean into the cooperative slash PVE space. So being able to build your own campaign missions uh, or doing like a firefight, which would be nuts, or a mix of PvP and PvE like a war zone, especially with the 7,000 object limit. Uh, if you guys don't understand just how large that is, uh, my Zeta Halo experiences, if you're new to my channel, just go look up some of my past videos. Um, the one that got featured by IGN and the one that um, uh, that I initially did, which was before Infinite even came out, were both only like four or five thousand objects. So you can do quite a bit uh, with that object limit. And um, they speak about the you know the addition of nav mesh uh, in the support of AI controlled bots. That's already given them a really good head start in this area. So. It's, it looks like this is something that obviously is a focus and that is very likely to happen. Uh, of course, things can change in game dev all the time, but um, it, it's just the idea that it's even potentially going to happen and that it's really being taken into consideration and that we have nav mesh in Forge uh, gives me a lot of hope for some insanely cool user-generated content because that is what's going to keep Halo uh, alive and and my opinion is what's kept MCC alive for as long as it has. Uh, we are not announcing anything today, but yeah, basically in the future, I would imagine within a year. Uh, and if you guys haven't actually checked out um, this article, you definitely should. There's a lot of really good information in here. Uh, Forge beta, like I said, is only three days away. There's so many, so many cool features. Like in actual game dev in studios, people use either Perforce or like GitHub and, and whatnot. And these are version history softwares that basically can save um, essentially what you see here, right? Like it, it this in Forge, what it's gonna do now is basically save all your saves so you can go back if by any chance something screws up. And um, it's just, it, it keeps you organized. It keeps your projects safe. And it's really awesome to see it in Forge. Um, the fact that we have a community file share is insane. I did not think this was going to launch right away with Forge, but with the custom browser only a couple months away, I know it's not ideal, but to have this, to have a weekly rotation of recommended popular maps, popular prefabs, and modes, um, I think it's going to do a lot for this community. And the collaborator editor is massive as well because when you guys are collaborating on maps in like halo 5 or 4 or 3 it was very messy people could steal maps people didn't really know their place or what uh, they were allowed to do or not allowed to do uh, in forge and there was a lot of trust involved now there's a whole system actually built in where you will be able to set um you know different roles for different people so yeah, there's just so many cool things now added to Forge, but this right here is absolutely the largest. This is such, such a big deal. Um, right here, what Joe Staten said, uh, the campaign AI, is it possible in Forge? It looks like it is, so uh, buckle up, everybody. We're in for a wild ride. A year is going to go by really quick, especially with all these fun game modes. Um, and yeah. I'm excited. I hope you are too. If you guys enjoyed this video, consider subscribing if you'd like. I'm going to be streaming a ton of Forge when it drops, and I will see you guys on the next video. I have Forge tutorials coming out. I have streams coming out. I have showcases coming out. I have game nights coming out. So stay tuned. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.